Hi, English Nomad here. This is episode number 26. And in this episode, I'm going to be discussing the progress on the electrical system. Um, but before I start, I would like to welcome all of the new subscribers. The number of new subscribers I've had, the number of people who've commented on the videos and the number of likes that I have been getting has been growing. And I really appreciate the interest that people are showing in the channel and what I'm doing in this, this particular channel. So um, it's, uh, it's a couple of days after Christmas. <clears throat> so I um, hope everyone had a lovely Christmas and uh, didn't uh, overindulge too much. I, uh, I had probably a little bit too much to eat on Christmas Day, but who doesn't? Um, Anyway, to uh, to make up for that, I spent the next few days working really hard on getting the electrical system in place. So as you can see, I've got the batteries and the charging system, the um, inverter and fuse box and cabling is all in place now. Um, and that's a sensible approach to take with a build like this. Before you put your furniture in, you need to get most of your um, plumbing and electrical system in, um, just like you would if you were building a house. You know, you build a house, you get it up to a certain stage, then you get the plumbers and electricians in to do the first fit electrics, first fit plumbing. That's exactly how I'm treating this build. So I've got all of the cabling in place, the solar panels are on the roof. The cables going through the roof and uh, the cables for the fans, the cables for the power to the kitchen, for the fridge, for the water pump. So this is where the water pump's going to be down here. So I've got power in place for that. And it's all ready to go, all fused. So, um, so that's what I've been doing for the last few days. And rather than um, do a, a really long video on the installation... I've decided to do a slideshow um, with all of the various aspects of what's been involved in doing the job and uh, put it to uh, one of my favourite uh, 1980s uh, electric uh, sort of funky type of music that I used to listen to when I was younger. Um, so I hope you enjoy that. Um, so what I'm going to do is at the... Uh, when it goes into the slideshow, I'll not come back and say goodbye. I'll just, I'll say goodbye at the end of this section. Uh, but one of the things I wanted to say before I do sign off uh, for this video is I'm going to do a video um, in the next couple of days, which will be discussing my plans for the upcoming year. Um, I'm probably around 70%, 75% through the build of this camper. And so... I'm well past the halfway mark and what does that mean for the channel? Well, the channel was always meant to be a vehicle to get people interested in what I was doing in terms of my life, transitioning from living a conventional lifestyle to living a more nomadic lifestyle and this build is going to facilitate that lifestyle. So... Over the next few months, you'll see the camper being finished and uh, and I've got big plans for next year. So I will discuss those in the next video. Um, so until next time, um, please um, like this video. Please share this video. And if you are not already subscribed, subscribe and click the little bell ding finger me jig down here that, so you get the notifications. And um, as always, please comment below. So, see you next time, guys. Mike signing off. Hello, hello, hello.